is the ancient relics DLC. As you remember in the last episode, we started a war with the Fino Coalition. And, unfortunately, this is going to be a very slow war. If you're wondering why, well, as I mentioned previously, uh, the Fino are far to spread, and they have they have basically a thinly inhabited span of an empire, right? And Earth, or the main exosceles, is apparently uh, we're reaching full capacity. I mean, we still have 12 jobs, but we have 9 housing, and yeah, as amazing as it may seem, it seems that robots have improved faster than humans or than any inhabitants in the planet. And robots are also taking clerk jobs, which is fine with me. I, I mean, I don't mind. Clerk jobs are mostly the last jobs that are ever taken. Also, I'm not sure why the Finu are fighting against. Um, it's not the Amoeba. See, yes, it's this it's prisons. I don't know why they're fighting them right now. Uh, it's I, I don't think it's the right time to be doing that, but anyway, that's just me. Whatever, they can do whatever the hell they want. Now, with two fleets, theoretically, should be more than enough to take the, the planets of the Phoenix Coalition. We don't really need the the Federation to come in and, and help us. Also, yeah, it's just it's just a Cytherian for runners by themselves. If we ever wanted to declare war, but uh, that 200k fleet will completely tear us apart. And then they also have a another fleet of 126. And, and it's not that much, it's just, it's just, you know, that. Um, also, if you're wondering why the worst, we're gonna, keep, we're gonna keep getting that message plenty of times. Why? Because we don't have anyone that's doing the colonies, or the, or the colonist section. Um, and doing distributed, or, or no, this street looks pretty good. It, it doesn't do anything, honestly. It's just, it's this. Uh, we could, but it doesn't matter. And uh, the only reason why I don't understand why they won't or can't um, do this job, because I, I already checked and they have everything on, on them. They're full citizens and whatnot. So I don't know why they can't be. Construction uh, complete. So, I mean, beats me. What's going on there? As for the rest of the of the planets, because see, some of the planets, for example, this one, it's already rich full capacity for a mining world. Um. It, I mean, it's a 16 size planet. There's still one blocker that we could take out, but we need to upgrade some of the buildings. And but even with the upgrades of the buildings, it's still not enough. See, this, uh, that's again, it's it's not bad planning. It's just that we need resources to push for that, get more people in into those jobs, which are gonna come in the future, not right now, and then. Probably, probably, uh, because that planet, see this is the thing, specifically for that planet, there's a four blood time watts that we can pick up, I they didn't even know that was possible, to be honest, I didn't know it was possible, that's great, blood time watts is not something that just pops out of anywhere, maybe it does, maybe it's, it's the, the most common of the rarest, um, like things they could find. I mean, it could be, it could be. I don't know. Um, see, see how many planets they have that we could 
in heaven. One, two, three, four, five. I'm, I'm just carrying five planets. Just, just from that, from that little space. Four. Sorry. Four planets that that we could, that we could pick up. So the, the I mean, I don't know what's up with the Finu, but um. Oh yeah, and we don't have the, the migration treaty with water subsidiary. We need to fix that. We'll fix that later on. Once once we get better relationships with water subsidiary, uh, which is uh, this this might sound like I'm going around. We also need to get um, we need to finish our current tradition. Is it tradition? Uh, I don't know. Maybe I'm, maybe I'm maybe I'm confusing that with. Civilization 5. But anyway, so we need to finish that in order to start with the diplomatic one. Because this this is something that I'm checking. I'm, it's like, oh, we're in the space of 200 and we there's trust and whatnot. Um, but I would like to have better relationships because, for example, with the with the Great River in our union, sure. I mean, we are... Another bleeding edge very technology good relations, discovered. Even though you probably completed the spices and want to kill us um but i will i would rather have higher relations with them definitely higher relations time to get more research oh no never mind never mind that i thought i was gonna i was gonna keep that but no and you see the the upgrade for for the gene clinics, that's 140 days. That's half the time because of that research that I took for for the. No, it's not planetary modules. It's it's whichever is the name. The rare technology that allows you to build at 50% of the time. And now, for the main course, we are about to attack the. I think it's the main fleet of the Finu. It's not much of a challenge, but the thing is that I wanted to bring backup for the Herald. Because I don't want the same problem to repeat itself as last time. Where I would just send in the, the Grand Herald and it will just get stuck. Not doing anything. And as you can see, we're still very far away from winning this war. Our, our separation of exhaustion is just minimal because we haven't taken a single planet and, and yeah this 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 is a little bit of a war of attrition and I mean the female have it all the time all the world right now I mean that that's that's kind of obvious that they can just continue to push for time and whatnot because of how large they are and wow, that 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 raid never ceases to amaze me. Completely never ceases to amaze me. Extra bio research or society research. I'm sorry. That society research. That's gold. Every time, seven, seven. Genius. So again, with the with the battles, just. That dead ray. So again, this is how we do it. When we upgrade a colony, upgrade the colony, rubber assembly plant, gene clinics. Because that way you get robots, and you get the extra, the extra biopop. Also consider this: if you have the extra food, just start throwing the, 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 edict for growth, the local one, and. Uh, I think it's plenitude of food, or I don't know what's what's the global edict that you can do. But I mean, that's since it gives you, it, it, you consume more food, pops grow faster. Like I think it's ten percent for the beginning of the game. That's a lot, and it's time to elect a new governor, Not a new governor, a new president. But as as usual, I don't. I don't elect one. I just 
just let it be. Only when, when it's just super necessary. And one of the times when I did that, I elected the same person to continue governing, and they died like the next year. And it was it was a huge waste of influence to do that. So I said, you know what? Screw it. I'm just gonna leave it as it is. And it wasn't. Just to be clear, it wasn't when I was a corporation. I was a scientific directorate. I, I think that was the first ever empire that I played. And I was pumping research like mad. It was just obscene the complete. amount of research that I could just push on uh, so early on the game. It was, it was an interesting play, to say the least. Completely great stuff. Four players at the time. Yeah, it was four of us. Completely marvelous. I mean, I, I highly recommend playing this game with people. The AI doesn't do justice to the game. Now, the way it is. Before, eh, kind of, kind of did, kind of didn't. It was, it was. There was a lot of stuff missing, and there was a lot of stuff that needed to be fixed and added and whatnot and uh, whatever. Right? It's just whatever. So it's time now for the naval invasion, and the reason why I call it naval invasion is not because of Hearts of Iron Four. It's actually because of Legend of the Five Rings. If you ever play the TCG, by the end of the TCG, um, I think it was the I was in the Dragon Clan, and it was in the Unicorn. It was the Jesus, I can't remember the name of the clan. It was some. I, 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 yeah, I can't remember the name of the clan, but the thing is that the, one of the things that they had was a naval invasion. Our troops just Boy, trying to stop a naval running. invasion was hard as hell. Same thing in this game. Now, so, he, see here, a relic world. I kept wondering what the hell this was for the longest time. I did my research. As, as I was recording this, because I was intrigued to know. And I'm also noticing that, yes, so there's no agricultural district. There's a lot of, of housing districts that you could build, industrial and minerals, no agriculture. And that makes sense. See? It makes sense because this planet used to be in a commonopolis. Now it's nothing. It's just gone. And there's a lot of cleaning up that you have to do in order to use this single planet. I, 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 I understood what, what Paradox meant because they said that you could find this, this type of planet. I thought that it was going to be a special event. It isn't. It is actually a type of planet. And that one of the benefits was that there was going to give you a lot of research. And that's great. Um, obviously the problem with that is, yes, you get a lot of research, you get a lot of stuff, but planet is just full of trash basically and you have to clean it up and I was like oh boy that's that's super exciting that's a lot of wasted money also we need to get civilian industries like right now like right now because again we are short more harvest and traps I'm gonna do those on the planet Porch world. No more housing. And again, this is kind of ironic because I've had games in which I don't need to be doing this. Like I, I don't have to be playing around with minerals. I have minerals that, that they're just like all over the place. I just have minerals up top, like 200, 300, 400. In this run, no can do. No, definitely not. I mean, we are spending way too many minerals in in, in goods and and I think even in maintenance. I'm not even sure. I, I need I need to I need to look it up and and understand what is the what is the, what is the highest consumption of resources or minerals rather, not resources. Aside from the obvious, I mean, those those consumer good factories are just 
devastating our mineral economy. And and also I think that yeah, I think that problem is that we don't have enough workers working in the mines. Again, that's another reason why I, why I had to buy so many robots because it was impossible to do it any other way. Also, our allies are just helping us right now, and I also noticed that they're going through the Scythorian Forerunner's territory. Apparently, not everyone is in bad terms with them, so that's fine, I guess. And if memory doesn't fail me, uh, we should be getting very close because I was thinking maybe we could just let the ticker run. But that 58%, yeah, we still, we still we need to take at least one more planet, and I, I don't think that's gonna cut it. But anyway, that's gonna be it for this episode. Thank you very much for tuning in. Remember, if you have comments or questions, leave them down in the comment section below. Like, share, or subscribe if you haven't done so. Thank you very much for tuning in, and have a good one.